My name is Dr. Pirawan Pan, and I'm going to be talking about Etomidate. Etomidate is a hypnotic medication approved by the FDA for in IV induction of anesthesia. It has also been used in an off-label manner for sedation. Etomidate works by increasing the availability of GABA receptors by displacing GABA antagonists. Benefits of Etomidate include hemodynamic stability, rapid onset of action, usually within one minute, short duration of action, and a predictable dose response relationship. Disadvantages include no analgesic effects, no blunting of sympathetic response to intubation, and adrenal suppression, which could last up to 24 hours. One commonly seen side effect of Etomidate is myoclonic movements, which could be mistaken for seizure. The incidence of etomidate-induced myoclonus can be reduced by giving a small amount of midazolam prior to injection. Without pretreatment, the incidence of myoclonus has been quoted to be up to 80%. Other side effects of etomidate are nausea and vomiting, and transient pain on injection. The intubating dose of etomidate is 0.2 to 0.6 milligram per kilogram IV. In terms of sedation, several dosing regimens are available, one of which is 0.1 milligram per kilogram IV bolus times one to three doses. For etomidate overdose, there is no antidote. 